Professors at the University of North Texas are concerned about a policy that restricts them from bringing outside groups into class to discuss voter registration. UNT officials say it is not a new policy. Fox for Stephen Dial, live with more on that. Stephen. Two UNT professors I talked to told me they've been doing this for a number of years in their classrooms on campus. This comes at a time where things are very scrutinized when it comes to the election process. Everything in politics today is just charged with a lot more sensitivity than it was in the past. We're a more polarized society. We have more closely contested elections in Texas. So you put those things together and people are just more on edge than they were 10, 20, 30 years ago. The University of North Texas recently told its instructors the classroom is not the place for groups to share information about voter registration. The university told Fox 4 it's not a new policy. They say, according to Texas government code, there are specific provisions of Texas law that prohibit using university programs and classes for political purposes. In accordance with state law, UNT ensures that all voting and voter registration resources are nonpartisan. Class time is the period of time a class is held. Voter registration tabling is facilitated across campus outside of instructional time. A lot of people perceive that if there are aggressive efforts to register college students, that that has a disparate partisan impact and is more likely to benefit Democrats than it is to benefit Republicans. And so that creates a dimension of partisanship. Bringing nonprofit groups in to speak about voter registration is not uncommon. UNT journalism professor Tracy Everbach told me, quote, I have voter registration groups come to my class for years. This is the first time the administration has ever said they are prohibited. None of these groups have ever been partisan or told people who to vote for. Neither have I. Matthew Eshbaugh Soha has taught in the political science department at UNT since 05. He says this is the first he's heard of the restriction, saying in a statement, our political science classes explicitly teach about voter registration and having this hands-on activity in class, I would think, is a greater teaching tool and very much in line with our teaching mission. Matthew Wilson teaches at SMU which is a private school. He also allows nonpartisan groups to talk about the voter registration process. Having a group that specializes in that come to class can be a natural addition to the curriculum. The news from UNT comes weeks after the University of Texas system approved a policy prohibiting its schools from making political or social statements. With so much scrutiny of the election process this cycle, Wilson offers this opinion. On one hand, they have a lot of faculty and a lot of student activists who lean to the left and who want them to really lean into left-wing causes and left-wing politics so they get that pressure. On the other hand, they've got a state government that is controlled by conservative Republicans that will slap them down. And to be very clear, UNT is still allowing uh, voter registration drives to happen on campus. This is specifically tailored to voter registration information being shared inside the classroom. UNT will also serve as a polling location for the November election. All right, Stephen, thanks.